I had multiple people come up to me and, and, and just express some encouragement and say, you know, hey, <clears throat> you know, I'm, I'm true Mountaineer. You know, I appreciate what you've done here because uh, yeah, you've given it, you know, your all, which I have. I've given it, you know, 110 <clears throat> percent. So uh, I just appreciate it. I really do. Can you say what you uh, told Dana when you walked out? No, sorry. Uh, thank you for the opportunity. Um, thank you for, for giving me a chance and believing in me. Cause that's, that's another one of those people who believed in me. And uh, ever since he came out and, and, and visit with, visited with me in California, I uh, said thank you for the opportunity. Um, I love you. When you walked out of the weight room onto the field, was that all those cheers? Was that the kind of reaction that you expected to get when you came out? <clears throat> I didn't. I, I wasn't even thinking about it. Uh, I wasn't. I didn't have any any. Okay, I'm gonna expect cheers. Okay, I'm gonna ex expect booze. I wasn't thinking about that at all. Um, I was just thinking about the game and, and going out there, hugging my coach for the last time, uh, you know, running onto the field and just enjoying the day. I told myself that I was just going to enjoy, enjoy the day and, and uh, go out there and play some ball and, and, uh, and, and enjoy it. And that's, that's what I did. I wasn't worried about anything, but I do appreciate, you know, the way, they, you know, the way Mountaineer Nation sent me off. I do. <laughs> now, as much as Dana has pissed off, had to to you over the last two and a half or three years, whatever it is, uh, what are your thoughts on his getting the contract extension and uh, what he means to the program? On if he should or not? What's that? On getting it or if he should or not? No, he, they said yeah, he did. Yeah. Well, I don't, you know, that's, that's way the, above my head. I don't, I don't really hear about, you know, news like that or anything, but, I mean, he, he's... He's built this, you know. He's, he's built this up. We're, we're at double-digit wins in regular season. Uh, he's, I think this is his first class with recruits um, to go all the way through. So, <clears throat> and and he's a genius. He really is. Offensively, he's a genius. And so, I uh, I appreciate what he's done with me, uh, giving me the opportunity. Always believing in me, um, believing in me, no matter what. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate him. I really do. And I love him. Personality-wise, as a coach, what does he do for a team? Um, bring some passion. Um, he, he's passionate. He really is. He uh, he's gonna give you all he's got, just as just as I do. And give it out. You know, give it all you got throughout the whole week. Though he he's passionate like that, twenty-four-seven. Skyler, how much of what we saw today was a product playing seven straight weeks? A lot, yeah, a lot of guys getting plugged in there. Um, a lot of, you know, they were doing some different things on defense. So, um, not that we weren't, you know, executing with those guys. Uh, it's more they were taking everything away. They they did some different stuff on defense. Um, that, that you know, slant guys, you know, moving guys around in the box, we just kind of junking everything up, and then backing everybody up to where we couldn't take shots. And, and um, you know, we love we love to take shots when they're there, uh, but they just weren't there today. We had a few opportunities, um, but they ultimately they just weren't there.